I don't know what's going on with me. I, I feel like I'm PMSing all the time now. I think maybe I'm going through pre-menopause. Oh. Something I don't want to admit. <laughs> that I just did. Oh. That sucks. Depression, anxiety. <sighs> Craving sweets. Breaking out from eating bad. I eat two waffles at home. I'm craving mocha. So instead of having this I'm craving chocolate and mocha coffees, and so I'm having a little bit of organic coconut creamer to fix my sweets. I didn't put chocolate in it or coffee. I don't want to, um, I'm going on two hours sleep. My sleep schedule is messed up. Been up all night, up all day. <sighs> Just trying to transitioning into one job to another, and it's just so complicated. Going through a lot. You know, I post all these shallow posts. Have a great day. Have a great week. Getting some sun. This is what I'm eating. But really, behind the scenes, I'm just, like, miserable, depressed, stressed out, anxiety. 2023 has been another challenging year. Lots of lessons to be learned, trying to find my purpose and trying to make all the right decisions, trying to figure out why I am where I am in every aspect of my life. Um, just um, trying to figure out who the real people are that I need to keep in my life, the type of people I want to associate with challenges at work, trying to find my purpose, every day, every moment, um, dealing with bullies constantly, and, um, yes, at my age, I'm dealing with bullies, <clears throat> trying to find um, lessons every day with challenges at work and my personal life and <sighs> dealing with real estate and yeah trying to get back into TV and film and making time and I don't know Thank you all who have reached out to me wanting to work with me to get back in the TV and film. I can't even make the time to go to meetings or and do what I really love to do and I'm passionate about because since the pandemic and the strike, I've been caught up with all these other jobs and responsibilities now that I have to clean up and clear up and finish so I can get back to doing what I love. All a transition and hopefully 2024 is going to be better, but I just have a feeling <laughs> there's going to be more lessons and challenges along the way. I still need to be learning and, um, I'd love to be, to open up and talk about all that, but since I'm going through it right now, it's not something I should talk about any, any of it while I'm processing it and experiencing it. Maybe one day. 
Um, until then, I'm going to be sweet and sweet and positive and, and just wish everyone a good day and a good week and a happy new year and best wishes to all of you. And know if you're going through challenges right now, it's not just you. <laughs> just trying to not be so negative on social media, but I'm with you. I'm feeling it. I'm feel I feel you. <laughs> Stay strong. And um just live moment to moment and don't miss those lessons and don't miss those moments. And don't have any regrets. That's all I'm saying. No regrets. I don't want to have any regrets. And that's the thing that hangs over me every day. Asking myself every day. No regrets. No regrets. Are you going to regret if you do this or you do that? Or if you don't do this, you do that instead. Instead of taking the safe route, <clears throat> the more comforting comfortable route are you going to have regrets for not taking chances or taking the tougher route you know because right now while I'm going through this struggle I know I'm just like oh I should have taken the easier route but um, I know in the future I'll be much happier and <sighs> yeah. Not compromising right now and mm, having faith, courage, and integrity to go live the life of moment to moment authentically and honestly yeah have a good week everyone <laughs> good night